Hi everybody, Chris Bryant here. Today we've got a CCNA and CCNA Security Lightning Round Practice Exam. Might go a little longer than most of the Lightning Rounds because we've got some very important terms in today's VPN exam, what does what. And speaking of CCNA Security, you definitely want to make a point of joining my free CCNA Security Bootcamp Preview on Udemy. I'll put the URL in the YouTube description box. It'll be all over the internet and our websites as well. Because not only are you going to get free preview videos as I develop that course and some free practice exams, but you're also going to get a 60% discount on the finished course. And I know that you're going to enjoy both the course and that discount. Now let's talk about these four terms. Authentication, encryption, integrity, and confidentiality. All very important to a VPN, obviously. But which one of these terms would describe a process where the recipient of, a v of data across a VPN assures itself, if you will, that the sender of the data is who the recipient thinks it is. So basically, the recipient is making sure that the sender of this data is really the sender of this data and that we don't have some kind of man in the middle attack going on. If you want to pause the video for a moment and think about your answer, that's great. Let's go ahead and actually a quick description of each of these terms. And we'll start with encryption. Now, what I just described is not encryption, but encryption is something, excuse me, that we all run into early in our CCNA studies. Remember with the enable secret password and it shows up in the encrypted format in the iOS. That's what data encryption really is, but that doesn't describe this particular process. Now, integrity is something that sounds really great, but what exactly is integrity? That's referring to the recipient's ability to ensure that data was not affected as it went across the VPN. So while integrity, data integrity, is something the recipient is looking at and performing, it doesn't quite describe what I mentioned earlier. Now, confidentiality, that's just simply the overall term that means that only the devices that should see the data in an unencrypted form do see the data, pardon me, in an unencrypted form. So that only leaves one, and the full term for what I described earlier is data origin authentication. I had to make it a little tougher for you because I know you know your stuff, but data origin authentication is when the recipient of data in a VPN runs a process to make sure that the sender of the data is authenticated. So really it's kind of a reverse authentication because it's not always about the sender authenticating the recipient. The recipient may be authenticating the sender as well. And that wraps up today's lightning round. Like I said, come on out and join me on udemy.com. Look forward to seeing you there and on YouTube for daily lightning round videos. I'm Chris Bryant. Thanks for making TBA part of your Cisco certification success story.